think Tower Hamlets in this area is really a really weird area because of Canary Wharf and these bubbles of sort of corporate enterprise and then you walk down another road and you've got really high unemployment and just complete lack of opportunities and the two don't link together so when I walked Canary Wharf I walked through three different complete areas and it's really really strange to see that I think. Hi this is the Leaders in Community office. We're very in your face with local people so that they know who we are. When we first started we specialised in dealing with just young people. Um, when we come to the Bedetta Estate and we start working on say the Leopold project or various other projects um, what we do now is inclusive of everyone. Um, it's, it's, it's been a long journey, it's been difficult, I mean we've had to persevere a lot and showing that politics affects everyone. I think young people do need to be political, they do need to challenge what they see around them and question the situations that they find themselves in. We also provide an alternative to what's out there for local young people. We're not just a youth service provider, we actually have a different power structure for young people. We, well, we ask young people to get involved in governance, decision making, but we do it again in a creative way so that they understand the impact they are making to themselves and to the community. It's extremely important for us as an organisation to build a network of people. Uh, mainly because um, it's a people power issue, you know, with the more people that you have, the more impact you're going to have and the more relevant it's going to be to community and uh, also the, the people are, the, are your tool and they're the best tool to have because they will then reach to other people. Everyone's so. special, everyone's an individual and everyone's got a story and they're special. And I think the next phase is they, they, they take control of the project themselves, they know what they want for themselves and they, they, they deliver. I mean, in that area, in the, in the area we're living in, in St Paul's Way area, we've, we've got two estates, Leopold and Bedet, and we've got lots of service providers, there's schools, there's doctor surgery, there's leisure centres, and there are things that are not right, I mean, or, or they feel should be changed. And I think this group have got the potential to form together, be, manage themselves and change things around them. There are many challenges that we face, mainly because we're such a small organisation um, and it's very difficult to get a lot of funding in and that means that sometimes, and actually a lot of the times, that we're kind of forced to be uh, put in a box and actually deliver according to what maybe our funders have asked for or what our, you know our partners have asked for. So that, that's a big challenge we have to overcome on a regular basis because it affects what we believe in uh, and it affects our creativity. Yeah, it was asked by London citizens to um, help with their outreach push to just basically just raise awareness of the fact that there is um, an election, a mayoral election going on on May the 3rd. They've got a really good insight into what a lot of uh, the elderly generation think, a lot of what people's mums and dads think. Um, they even know, they can even like, cross-reference and find out what do people in Bedette think as opposed to people in Leopold. Do they all have a common kind of interest living in this area, despite the fact that they don't really get along with each other, that they're all on the same page politically? So, I mean, I've had the pleasure, the, 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 the privilege to get to know them, get to know them, get to know their stories. So I think we've got to give them time. And, and that builds, and once they realise you're not just another person, you're there to tick a box, tick a number, build a stat, you, you, you really care for them, they, they, they open up and they, 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 they come to you. I feel so good. Yeah. It's a nice, like, any time I'm going out, it's people talking, I know the lady, I know the child, because any boys doing anything bad, if they saw me, they stop because they know me very well. Because children going, oh, I know the lady, that's my friend's mom. Or that's, uh, that's the lady we went to the trip with her. That's the lady she walks in the cafe we connect. That's the lady she walks in the, with the popular hair car. So that's the way. So these boys, when they saw me, they said, hello, how are you? Fine. We are making change and we're impacting people's lives. So that's uh, politics there. Politics is a very, very relevant thing. It's not something you need to think about when you're in your 40s or even when you're like 10, 11, 12, it doesn't matter, it's, it applies to everyone.